They did that beer placement though in like Scream Six. <laughs> There's just what? Coors Light, like Oh my yeah, what a what a plug. I'm always so curious about product placements in movies. Like, do they go ask the brands first? Would they like to be in the movie? Do they pay to be in the movie? I, I think I think they have a I think there's a team that goes to every single brand in their in their list of who they're connected with and just go, Hey, how much do you want for this long in the movie or this portion of the movie? We have a we have a gas station scene. We could put your beer. I think they like sell yeah. it. And then they decide if they want to be a part of it. I mean, that's just like any campaign yeah. or any. I bet Coors even general. like has something with Paramount Plus where it's like sure, all yeah, it might for be the like whole a, movie. a bigger contract. Anytime, anytime there's a scene where you're it's a uh, you're in a, a near a fridge or in a gas station or at a store. Was there ever a product placement in a movie that you actually were like sold on? Yes, um, um, the movie Addison Ray did. Holding the chips. Oh yeah, just uh, the uh, the, Wait, the, the he's all that. No, I'm kidding. Oh. <laughs> I, that was the first time I've ever seen a movie where it was that, like, that many. Super obvious. Where I, it was so obvious, I yeah. just couldn't. But in my head, is it like they made a lot of money? I don't know. Did they make a lot of money in that movie, or was it just? Was it like cheap plugs? I just uh, hate when it's so obvious. What, like yeah. they're, they're it was eating a bag of Dorito, so unrealistically. Right? Yeah, they're the labels perfectly the, like, facing out. And dr drinking <laughs> like this. Yeah. yeah, yeah. The perfect way to do it is like um, we just watched something. I forget what it was. Was someone who was holding a bag of Cheetos, and you only saw the seat. Scream, scream, scream. Had Cheetos. Okay. It's, they were full of them. In scream yeah, six. you saw it just to see, and you know exactly yeah, what that you know was. What you is. don't right. need to see the full thing. The minute you see the full thing, you're oh. looking at the bag of chips, and right. not in a good way. And the you're character like, even offers the other character like to eat the Cheetos, yeah. Yeah. right? And they're not even talking about anything related. As we to have an Olipop float up. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> <laughs> Backflips. Oh, oh, they keep saying uh, oh, the way Mariah's editing that in there. <laughs> it's not. Imagine you sitting there trying to make that. Come on. Honestly, yeah, we would have no idea how to do that. <laughs> I'm, I'm, gra grab the Olipop. Where is uh, what Olipop? Grab it right about? there. It's right next oh, to the you. The virtual yeah, one. Grab it. Oh, yum. Drink some. It, oh, I love this flavor. This is the cherry limeade flavor. Mm. That really is my favorite. Gulp, 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 gulp. Yum. <laughs> There's There's that that Set it back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was funny. All right, should we jump into it? Let's do it. Roll it, baby. Let's go. <laughs> We haven't even we haven't even started right, come yet. Come on, we're we're we going. It's coming time, time, baby! Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Yeah. Welcome back to Zayn Heath. I'm Phil Ted. Mm. Zayn Heath, Matt Mariah. Woo! And we are in the oh. Oh, <laughs> okay. We're one of those episodes. Let's we do are it. we are running. It's gonna be a five minute episode, baby. It's gonna be the quickest one ever. Can you imagine if we did a five minute episode, Mike? Super short oh, show. I, but if we like, no, if we recorded for two hours and cut it down to five minutes, I think we could do it. Do get all the ah, get I'm all like, the moments. I wonder if people do listen to us on like two times speed. Do you, have you ever like done that for like an audio book? I've people? listened. I've listened to a video on two times speed, oh, and I'm no. actually able to um, process shit better. Really? But yeah. I should do oh, that yeah. more. I actually understand it more when I'm listening something uh, to something faster. It's weird how your brain, though, when it's used to two times speed, it suddenly like adjusts, and it, oh. the person doesn't sound that fa that fast anymore. Yeah. But then when you get distracted for something, and then you listen back to it, it's like super fast. It's it's a weird. I, I know that's how a lot of editors edit too. Yeah. They, they edit in speed so they get they get done faster. <laughs> but Mariah, <laughs> rethinking the last five years. Mar Mar Mariah would listen to it on the slow <laughs> version. I don't want to miss anything. Just to make sure it makes I didn't even sense. know you could do that. Yeah. yeah. That's how I catch up on all the drama on like a YouTube channel. Like I'm like, <laughs> where do funny. they get to the T? Yeah, yeah, Just, yeah. It's like the, uh, have you seen people, they'll, they'll have like a huge paragraph and it'll either be like jumbled up letters but you can still process it. Like you can read it. Yeah. But then some oh. of them will be like the first and like the last letter are bolded and you could read like five times faster. Yes. Yeah. Or you get like keywords. You can also read faster when the words just flash in front of your eyes yeah. one at a time. You can, dude, the speed is insane that your brain can process it, but it's way faster than actually trying to. It is. Honestly, I wish they had that shit in, when I was in high school and middle school because I feel like I would have passed my shit. Yeah. Better. So or, yeah, some people yeah. say like speed reading instead of just reading one word at a time to just look at three words at a time yeah. as you just read and then that will like jump it up. But I have a hard time just regular reading. <laughs> I, yeah, I was just about to say the same thing. I 
I, if you gave me a book right now, I wouldn't understand. I'm telling you right now about 20% of the words. What do you mean? What? Like, because, okay, so <laughs> but, look, I know books tend to have a lot of like, Big words in it. Read, they, uh, yes, they do. All the books I had to fucking read. Every book I had to read in school, I couldn't understand any of the words because they're all big words. I mean, maybe not anymore. Look at, but like I remember in high school, I'm reading and I couldn't understand it. I couldn't understand what's going on. My thing is, I'm I could read. I'm good at reading, but I can't multitask. Where I. I can't read and comprehend what the hell they're yeah. talking about. My bad. Oh my God. Is I'm that so what sorry. you meant? Yes. Okay. Comprehend what I'm reading. Not, I can actually read. <laughs> I was thinking about just words. I'm like, no, <laughs> no, I can read the whole page. I'm, I wouldn't come. I don't know what's going on. Yeah. I just can't multitask like that. Yeah. Mm, that's well, that, <laughs> we put that as multitasking, just reading and understanding what you're reading. Yeah. I'm just multitasking. multitasking is just not I'm really thing. good at reading. I'm good at like the flow and stuff, but <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. no it idea what, what I'm saying. It's just like music. I think we talked talk, talk oh, about this before music. I pee pee, khaki, poo poo. But ooh, if it sounds good, Me baby. And I'm, Zane I'm, singing I'm lyrics I'm, are so just so confident i've cried to songs <laughs> not listening to the words no because it's sad yeah i don't need because i don't understand what i'm listening I, to i just can't but it just sounds i just can't hear what, it, <laughs> you I, can't, can't, I, can't, I can't hear the words like heath will stop the music and be like what did you think that was <laughs> oh yeah she'll be singing along and i'll hear what the words that, like that she's saying and i'm like what song are you yeah. like? It's not even. I'd close. be so good at like if they. Oh. What's a what's a show like a uh? It's not singing B, but what's a show where people try to like sing exactly what the song sounds like? Oh, it it was uh it was the singing. Finish the lyric. Finished. Maybe I don't know, but a show like that I'd be incredible at. I wouldn't have to. I wouldn't get any of the words right, but it sounds like I'm, I'm getting the up. words right. Yeah. There is nothing worse when you're jamming out to a song that you think you know like the back of your hand and you're killing it, and then your friend goes damn, I got to get this. And then they pull out their phone and it's the fucking moment you don't know the <laughs> lyrics. No. And then they're like- Todd then, does it to me all the time. And then they're like, post it. You're like, no, I you just fudged up the lyrics. But when I get Todd, I can never- <laughs> <laughs> Todd is never getting it oh, right. Yo, yeah. you know Todd oh, yeah. never Todd. gets the no, words right. No, what Todd does, I will play Todd a song for the first time. We'll like be in the car and I'll play it. Be like, oh, you should, I think you'd like this song. Halfway through, he tries singing along to yeah, it. Yeah, I'm yeah. like, bro, if you like it, that's cool. But like, I don't, you don't need to try to sing along. Uh, just show me that you like yeah. it because I know you don't know it. So he's, uh, 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 Todd is literally uh, a golden retriever. Dude, Todd, yeah. Todd has been listening to Robbers by the 1975 for years and he still <laughs> no, doesn't no, 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 know no, no, no. the fucking word sometimes. I'm like, yo, you play this song like every time Wait, you take a shower. That's actually, that's me. <laughs> I could play it over and over and over again and I still get it wrong. But I love, I love music. I know, me too. I, I really, I do connect with it. Like I when I listen it. to a song, it really pulls me in. Music is the but best. I do not, I just don't know what's going on. You know no. what lyric I just found out that um, it, it just ruined my childhood? Uh, Blink-182. It's I wore cologne. No, not, it's not I walk alone. I, it's I wore cologne. To get because, the feeling right? Yes. Oh, I thought it was I walk alone. I thought so too my whole life. And then I just recently found the whole world. I also thought never that. knew like my little red mill. Remember he's like, yes, my little red mill. I never really caught that until like I did it karaoke one time. And I'm like, oh, red mill, my, or my windmill. My little, no, my little red mill. Yeah. <laughs> get it's wrong. <laughs> the confidence. I, I also can't match uh, artists with the song. There's songs that I, do know backwards and forwards and everyone's like who sings this i'm like i have no idea i'm yeah. such a little dork i I'll, I'll hear songs and i don't even know what song it is but i can identify the singer yeah and i'll always like be like do you know who sings this oh you're nasty uh, <laughs> I do to mike and patricia <laughs> all the time i'm like because i do like I, oh my I, god I, you're I, know. Nasty. I try to avoid watching music videos because music videos to me Ruins ruins songs completely. Really, when, I when I seen a music really video really in like a song, years. I have to watch the music video for like with the song for the first time. If I really like a song and I'm like, let me check out the music video. If I don't like the music video, it just ruined the whole song for me. <laughs> oh, you you know what YouTube needs to do though. Their music video suggestions, it's always like what you just listened to, and they're not giving you like the new good music videos on there. Okay, I'm but always don't they very usually just give you what um. Kind of like Spotify, they give you something that's recommended, recommended to like, to like what? Just show me the new 
fucking hits of like the new cool they music videos. They don't do that. I feel like when they you're do. signed into your own YouTube channel, man, it's just like oh, it's just like what what tea what tea drama channels have you been to, like? To be honest, though, with? music videos take me out of the song because they always like pause it, and then there's like some like moment where they're like on the phone, <laughs> they're and on like, like a yeah, Samsung they're, like, yeah. talking. galaxy, and I'm like, <laughs> oh, just oh, oh kind of like pop star by Drake. Like, just keep the song going. I yeah, I know, I know, I get it. <laughs> Zane, I always forget you're in that video. Yeah, you should have seen behind the scenes. <laughs> yeah, you know, you should have. If yeah, you got, I, it, never mind. You had to be there. Yeah, you, you just, <laughs> if, 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 but if, check it out. If you, Dude, I was at a party one time and someone was like, "Turn on pop star," and I'm like, "My," and I was he, in Alabama. I'm like, "My roommate <laughs> is in this music video." And I, I'm sure you did. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I did. I was like, Matt, "He's right Matt's there." Standing he's right in front there. of the TV, uh, he's looking at everyone's reaction. Right, we, right, we <laughs> went to we went to um it, right after that like music video came out. Right, I was in my I think you were in I, Miami. Was I in Miami? No, no I was on. I was on a, I was on a boat. I was like on my on a Ooh. friend's boat. Oh. It was a yacht, big changed, yacht party. You changed quick. Yacht after party, that right? Yeah. And all of a sudden, that song comes on because it's like the hottest right. song right now. And the song comes on. <clears throat> oh no, you did <laughs> not. Every, no, no, I did. Of course, oh, I didn't. I don't know. But I forget Todd. Todd. Todd was next to me. He's like, you know this song? There was a the music. I'm like, Todd, stop it. <laughs> Normally, never want attention. Yeah, but yeah. for that, I was just like, yeah, yeah if, you go ahead. if you want to check it out, then go ahead. Yeah, yeah, it's a bit of a strange video. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, because the first eight minutes is a is a skit. It's just, like written by a fourth grader. And then I woke up and it was all a dream. dream. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. But um, ooh, uh, last night was fun. The unfiltered crew went to watch a horror yes, movie. We did. That's that's our first time. The four of us watching a movie. We saw alone. Yeah, just us four. alone without our parents. Yeah, dude, we saw Evil Dead rises or evil, evil dead, dead rise evil dead risen dude my dreams after it like I, did you have violent dreams no i don't get violent dreams after i came movies. i yeah, came back either. and watched coco melon for like 45 <laughs> minutes just to like does clear it, my head do, no does it like ruin your sleep when you watch a horror movie before yes going to, really okay. yes i like stopped watching horror movies just because my brain goes to like a really really dark place after for like mm. the rest of the night and i just really don't like the way it feels um but after watching that, it's not that it was a very scary movie. It was just so gory, gory yeah. that I was just like seeing it. Yeah, was just, it felt like a classic. I and, and that's, yeah, I, that's why classic. I liked it because yeah. they they brought that like element to it. And yeah. that like made me really enjoy it. Oh my gosh! Yeah, I what what I'm a no I'm say a it Zane. You what? were saying this last it night. It was a great movie, right? And I and I feel like <laughs> I did. Films. And and hor I love horror movies. I love watching when it, when a new one comes out. I always want to watch it. But God damn it, why does every horror movie, when you're watching, the actors are never authentically acting to the situation that's going on? Yeah. Like your mom is fucking possessed by a demon. And like, why are you people. not acting like it? If your mom is come is on the roof looking at you with spiky teeth, <laughs> you're like, Mom, are you okay? Mom, are you okay? <laughs> mom's mom's like, acting what? a little different, right? Mom's acting strange. I, I absolutely hate I it. If I was there, if I was even just the next to the director, if I was there as an assistant, like, come on, we gotta sell this. I'd yeah. be like, more. I'd be like, hey, let's act like their mom is possessed. You don't think that right. like conversation is happening there? Like, why isn't anybody like the movie Hereditary? Oh, the, the acting. Every person is acting exactly the way they should be acting to the situation that's happening. Like, it, you're watching, like, damn, this is this is genuine. It sells good. it acting but he was telling me it's very hard to find good actors and not pay them a shit ton of money all and the good actors like are expensive. expensive but those actors who just booked their first big gig should realize how many eyeballs are going to be seeing this movie until like ham but it it's up not a the, bit. i don't think it's the actor's fault it's I not know. i'm not saying it's the actor's fault i think it's whoever is picking these people i think they really need to like yeah because mm -hmm. i believe they can they're very good at acting but yeah. i don't think they were corrected like let's take it this direction exactly yeah they yeah. were amazing actors but just have a teacher on set like hey let's go go in this direction let's do this <laughs> Uh, the, main, the main girl was unbelievable. Oh, though. she was oh, so. Oh, good. the mom. Yes. Oh. oh. I was saying, I really, ugh, I want to book a movie where I can stunt double as. The, yes, like as like the, a creepy crawly. That, yes. Why don't you do auditions like that? I should just because make a self tape and push it out. We should there. just make yeah, our like, own scary movie. There we go. I've been planning that for like five <laughs> years. I, I, brought, I bring that idea up every year for the past five years. But it sounds good. But then October hits and it's like, oh, well, this is going to take five months to make. I'd rather just, let's <laughs> we, save it to We got to start year. now. I feel like if we just did a shot like a week uh, all the way leading up, then you would really but have it, it done. It would take like, Zane, our weight would be <laughs> <laughs> like halfway through the movie. We're like, 
bag well, we, a little uh, bit bigger. We, we threw it like boyhood. <laughs> this, I, I think that'd make it a cooler the trailer. His like, hair is like three different colors. <laughs> <laughs> but it's like boyhood. That whole movie yes. took like, it, it, what, seven years to make? I think almost like 10. 10 From years 2001 to, make. to Realistically, I know you want it to be amazing, that. but we can spend an entire day just filming something and pushing out a five minute like horror movie. Mariah, no, you don't understand. I think I mean, we can film. I, I, we, I, I, Listen, Zane, I was in Dark Scary. <laughs> <laughs> All of them. It took us one day. Do one scary. day. What is Dark Scary? Thing. You, oh, you were you it? in a horror movie? Six, Wait, Matt doesn't them. know Dark Scary? Six of them. Huh? Wait, wait. You know, oh, you don't know How about does he Dark not Scary. not know about Dark Scary. Uh, give me the skinny. Just, just give yeah, me the skinny. Yeah, just, uh, tone it down. You've seen Halloween. Yes. Michael Myers. Yes. It's that, but with my <laughs> uncle and cousins. <laughs> oh, oh, I think I now know this. I thought, yes, 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 yes. So yes. her uncle will so, make these movies with Dark them. Scary. Oh, we're man. On the tenth Two one. adjectives. <laughs> 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 oh, but but Matt and I were watching. We were watching a TikTok of somebody doing like a horror movie trailer, but it was TikTok for him. And I and I and I oh, remember. Duncan, I, oh, yeah, yes. I remember saying that. I was like, you know what? Maybe that's doable because in my head it has to be like perfect and no. shot in this way. Yeah, I'm like let's just do it like that, but make it really good on iPhone, almost like. Uh, A24 releasing a movie that's like shot all shot on iPhone. Yeah, like maybe that's really cool and interesting to. That's what we got to do. Are you, you're talking about that guy that that plays like the wife and the husband. Yes, returns. yes. I Those are so. I'm on the edge. Wait, of wait, my wait. Seat. What, what is it? What's his name? A Duncan. I'm pretty sure. Duncan. He, yeah. I'll, he pull, makes, I'll pull him up. He's he's really good. good. They're like two minute horror trailers, but you're on the edge of your oh, seat. Oh, really? Masterpieces. He, he's the only person in it. Yeah, but, but it's just but him. He, and he has don't, different. Wait, don't get us wrong though. It's not like it's not serious though. It's it's. It's um, it's supposed to be shot like he's playing the wife easily. Okay. Yeah, it's just but like it's, it's edited just perfect. like a perfect horror got movie it, trailer, it. but it's yes. funny. Yeah. Like yeah, it, it's like it's, self aware. It's, really it's almost like uh, like a lifetime horror movie. Right, that right. vibe. And he, like he also did one where it's like a, like a detective or something, or like yes. uh, the, uh, someone goes missing. Yes, and he'll like he has like a, a movie like that. It's really. <laughs> oh, you don't have to pull it up. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I think we could do one for we sure. We could easily do one for TikTok. But like, we not, should. not like a trailer. Like, I'm saying, like an actual movie. We should do one that's like the podcast, like the Blair Witch Project, and it starts off with us like talking about so this old horror movie film. It's like, well, we should go visit it, and we go camping, and it's and then us. Matt's light goes out, yeah. and then we run into Sam and Colby at the haunted house, <laughs> and they're in. You know what's interesting though? It would be an insane challenge to give ourselves. Could we make? that style horror movie and like put it together. And if it sucks, it fucking sucks. But yeah. it's like, it'd be interesting to see we if it totally do. Oh. We just gotta like storyboard it out. But it could, it could suck though. Like there's a good, there's a good chance that it could suck, but it would be really cool to like attempt it yeah. at least to see um, how good we can make it. I think it'll be fun. It's all in the editing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Before we continue, we want to give a big thank you to our sponsor of this podcast, SeatGeek. If you don't already know, SeatGeek is a ticketing app that makes buying tickets to live events super simple. We've got the apps on our phones, and it's by far the best way to buy tickets. Whether it's concerts, baseball, football festivals, or more, SeatGeek puts tickets from all over the web into one place to make buying super simple. And SeatGeek even looked at the data, and it turns out our viewers love Bad Bunny, Steve Lacey, Harry Styles, and Kendrick Lamar, all of which are on tour right now. And with Lollapalooza coming up soon, guess where we're getting our tickets from yeah you got that right baby seat geek and seat geek wants to make sure you're getting a good deal so when you're on the app look for green dots green means it's a good deal and red means it's not the best deal exactly and settle down babies don't worry we've got the hookup use code unfiltered for twenty dollars off tickets at seat geek that's twenty dollars off your first purchase with promo code unfiltered and make sure to click the link in the description to download the app Thank you, CQ, for sponsoring today's episode. We love you. We always will, baby. Sorry, just, just it popped into my brain. Speaking of Sam and Colby, um, you know, Colby got his, uh, he got testicular cancer. Yeah, he just started. Um, yeah, I know. almost got it too. Oh, oh um, Zane. Um, well, glad he's doing okay. Um, but one of my other friends had testicular cancer as well. And he told me something is blew my mind. I didn't know this existed, um, but you can get a tumor, right? That grows hair, teeth, yeah. and like eyeballs basically. I'm sorry? A tumor. 
that will grow teeth. And assist as well. Yeah, yeah. I so it's a, it's a pretty much a new human I, growing? I don't understand. So it's like, yeah, it's a bunch of where like a lot of like germ I forget what it's cells called. It's a, and uh, stuff what like is it a collect. Wake up. Oh, it grows teeth. Is that it right there where your mouse is left? A teratoma tumor. That's what they're called. Yeah, that may actually be one. Yeah, there's hair and teeth in them in the tumor. Well, oh God. I, we can't even post that. Dude, that's a horror. That, that, we'll that's, go with that's itself discretion. Is, a horror movie. is that not the craziest thing? Yeah, I mean, it blew my, I didn't even, I'd never heard about this in my entire life until like a week and a half ago. Dude, that seems like a this. made up monster. Like that you would find it. That's our movie, the teratoma. There we go. Teratoma. <laughs> But it's terror, terror tone. Oh, good, yeah. Oh, okay. I'm Don't done. Google if you're gonna. Yeah, Erin had out. one of these, and she, I think she had to get, really? yeah, get it removed. And we had to like look at like X-rays of it, and she was explaining that there was like hair and teeth in her, and we were like, "What? Oh, wow, <laughs> oh, yeah, like, gave me the chills. yeah." I guess it's like wow. Really, it's really hard to make me like uh, squirm. To make me imagine, shake. imagine the first person to see one of these. I would think like a demon. Yeah. something was growing. I'd be, inside. I'd, I'd be, they probably I'd, killed the first person that yeah. had it in them. Amputate the whole section. Amputate. Yeah. Get rid of it. Oh. Man, no way. Tipa now that's Toma. horror. Well, that's it. <laughs> On a lighter note, uh, we just got back from Arizona. Yes. We did my uh, belated birthday trip. How was Finally. it? Finally. Unbelievable. So fun. I love it there. It's so nice. If Arizona had California weather, game over. I'd be, I'd it's be living It's really there. hot over there. I'd be living there. Really? It's weird because it's hot, but you don't sweat. I didn't sweat yeah. the entire well, I mean, it's dry heat. It's yeah. not. Yeah. It's not like Florida humidity. No, no, no. It's hot, but you can still enjoy yourself and yeah. walk around. But it was like a hundred degrees uh -huh. while we were there. Oh, we saw Theo Vaughn. I Killed love it. Theo Vaughn. He did a great job. Amazing show. So funny. It was so funny when he first came out. The first thing that popped into our heads was like, because he was, <laughs> I don't know if he was like hamming it up, but he was walking and I was like- He was like pacing I, back and forth. And he's kind of like a goofy walker. And I was like, I've never seen him like it, like walking before. And his first joke was him being like, I think I just realized some some of y'all haven't seen my walk yet. <laughs> and he's he, always just like sitting just on a podcast. A, yeah, he's yeah. such a goofy walker, but uh, very, very, very entertaining. I do want to go to a second show, even if it's the same setup. Because I have a feeling he improvs more than half of it anyway. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah he seems sure. like someone that would just improv every single one of his. He was just like, his... what else, what else, what else? <laughs> he's like, I know a kid, man. Yeah. He's, like, he's in my elementary class, man. He probably had like, yeah. he probably had ears that were like the size of like <laughs> two, two satellite discs, probably something like that. But maybe he was just a, uh, maybe he was just uh, from Iowa or something like that. Rambling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you get to uh, meet him? No, I didn't. I didn't like text him or hit him up or anything. I just wanted to like. Well, you don't, you don't text him up. Just be like. You go wave and you go. We weren't that close. <laughs> I don't think you would have seen I that. bought the tickets. We weren't that close. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I thought like he had like DM'd you guys. It was like, yo, come to my show, man. Oh, no, no, but what was crazy was the next day, uh, Noel was performing at the same exact oh, yeah, spot. Noel. Oh, whoa. Yeah. No way. So did you? Noel. No, we were uh, doing some other stuff. We were seeing La La Land on a rooftop. <laughs> the movie? We yeah. watched, yeah, La La Land's one of our favorite movies and they was playing at a theater um, on a rooftop. So we went and it didn't <clears> even <throat> get halfway and the screen <laughs> fell down. because no! it started falling so towards everybody. <gasps> but we were watching it happen and it was one of those things, <laughs> you know a like a tragic like event where you're watching <laughs> it unfold like in front of your eyes and yeah. you're in disbelief. You're delayed. Obviously it, like, it wasn't like you. that extreme or intense. Uh, but seeing it falling, you were just like, is this really falling right <laughs> yeah, now? Yeah, like, you were like confused. You're like not expecting it to be happening. Um, but yeah, it completely collapsed and fell down. Hit anybody? No. no. Uh, but here's and, the thing also, I'm sure everybody has seen that movie hundreds of times, so they didn't mind it falling. That's a little bit they, Well, they couldn't get the it back up, and then they canceled it. What? Yeah. So we Did you get your money back? We just yeah, got like a, a free admission for something. Yeah. <laughs> for, for, for next time, we're going back to Scottsdale. What I, what I was noticing about like our, people who live in Arizona, they are the nicest people. Oh my God. I think it's the kindest state in the world. Everybody was super friendly. In the world, in the United States. Everyone was so nice. So when the screen fell and they canceled it, not one person complained. They were like, all right, let's go. Where do you want to eat? Like, it was just <laughs> nobody complained. Yeah. And they were like, that's all right. It's windy. Like, what do you want to do? Just so understanding and sweet and just 
Oh, that's great. And the, pe- the 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 workers at Dutch Bros. Man, oh, yeah, y'all kept going. Dude, how many times oh my- did you go to Dutch Bros? Ten. Like at least ten times. We no, went. Really. We went. I'm not joking. We we were there ten for, times. We were there for four days. We joking. went either twice or three times in a day. Why? It's because we got something different every time. <laughs> they got these thing called Rebel. It's a it's called a Rebel. Yeah, and they take a Red Bull and then they like spike it with like a bunch of flavors and like cool stuff. But there's there's like twenty flavors of each drink, so it's like they have a banana like section. A and there's like stand. there's like twenty flavor. There's like twenty banana drinks you can choose from. There's twenty macadamia. Okay, look, I bet you they got that soda machine that has all them buttons. I, they, probably, they probably you probably think they're doing I'm, I'm all sure. the I'm sure, but they have what called the nine one one. Oh yeah, the, the drinks are funny. So what are these names? A d- double torture, annihilator. The annihilator. <laughs> I I got the banana freeze. <laughs> I've been to Dutch Bros. I don't know what I got. I've, I've never had it. There's one. The closest Dutch Farmer's Bros Branch. here is 50 minutes away. We're driving tomorrow morning. Where, if you want to yeah, go. But, but what what city? It's like Palmdale. By, yeah, Palmdale. Why don't they have one here if it's so popping? I have no oh, sure. idea. Because it'd be what? too busy. No, but like, think about it. If it's such a popping place, why don't they just go? Let's open up a location. If they're doing so well. Like why? I don't. Why, why don't these? I don't know. Don't it could be decisions? like there's competitors. It's very congested well, here. They're in like yeah. non-congested areas. Ah. Like plenty of parking lot. So they like, right. probably, they're like let Starbucks have them. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Dunkin' Starbucks. Yeah, yeah. Can you go eat in a Dutch Bros or isn't it just like a drive-up stand? So, yeah, right? it's like it's like Sonic yeah. vibes. Yeah. Kind of like walk up. Sonic. I forgot. It if reminds Sonic me. Is it reminds me of Sonic. Yeah. Sonic Minus used like to be burgers. good. I had Sonic recently and oh, I was us disappointed. Now. Really? Oh, yeah. yeah us too. They yeah, have great commercials. Did have great commercials. Not anymore? No. Do, do they still have commercials with those two guys? They changed the people. What? Oh, wait, the yeah. one sitting in the car? The two. Oh, oh sometimes they come back though. That's I like feel like. Yeah, but they, were, but they were everybody or every time. Yeah. You know what I mean? It was just always that. Hey, I think that should be me and you doing those. Dude, we could kill that. <laughs> That's Come like, on, Zadie. Oh, you guys would be, be great. perfect for Wait, that. Wait, we need to have a Cremota Cafe and just... Be in our own commercials. Yeah, yeah. that's yeah. cool. You should do that. We'll and you, that. you'll be in Big Red. Yes. Oh, he's he, a little egg, Easter egg. Where were we? Where someone was like, oh, they shoot a uh, drive through, blah, blah, blah. And you freaked out for five seconds, then you stopped. And I forgot to ask what you were talking about. Oh, when we went to um, Black Market Liquor Bar. What about it? We we went to go there. We had a meeting there like maybe like a week ago. Yeah. And we asked for the taquitos. And she was like, oh, sorry, we ran out. Um, We, uh, we had... Guy Fieri doing diners, drive-ins, and oh. dives here, and they they just cleaned us out of all the taquitos. They loved them. Whoa! And Crazy. I was like, they were just here, and she was like, yeah. And That's I was like, so cool. Damn. But but you know that that was the second time that we went through, and they said they were out of taquitos. We went two days earlier, and they said really? they ran out of taquitos. Do you think he came back and cleared out the t- taquitos again? <laughs> Guy Fieri. I mean, yeah, I would go back and clear them out. They are really They're good. Banging. They are. Did really we already good. talk about Guy Fieri doesn't eat eggs? <laughs> he doesn't. That's the one yeah. thing he will not eat. Weird. Like any type of egg. Like it doesn't matter what. He yeah. doesn't do eggs. So, but does he like eggs in his meals? Like, um, can, can you go to like I don't know? Can you go to uh, like not he, a picture? It's not like if you like bake a cake using egg, he's not going to eat the cake. It's just eating an egg. Yeah, just eating eggs. Have you ever eaten, eaten an egg raw? No, but I watched Jordan crack four raw eggs into a blender, <laughs> throw ice in it. Blend it and then drink it. Oh, he's traumatized. Fieri's hatred of I, eggs can actually be traced back to his childhood when he accidentally ate a rotten, hard-boiled egg. Um, mm, that'll do it to I you. I wonder. I mean, I wonder <laughs> how bad I could that is. But like, when people crack eggs and like drink it, you like I. That I feel doesn't like it look that that bad. I know to it me. doesn't. Like, I feel really? like you wouldn't taste anything if you ate like, yeah, a raw egg. I know they always like. It's always like ooh ooh when people do it, and I've never done it, and I know I probably like uh, ugh, won't like it. Should but we I do could, it? I could handle that more than like. But isn't the reason you're not supposed to eat raw cookie dough is because of eggs, right? But my babysitter would say that all the fucking I don't time. understand it. But then you have cookie dough ice cream. Yeah, yeah. There's a raw eggs. But, in but it. cookie like, dough ice cream has cookie dough. I think there's certain cookie doughs that don't have egg in it. Because mm. of the raw egg. I don't know. Well, they have they have like the edible uh, cookie doughs in the jars. That's not the same that as shit, the cookies. That shit is not good. I no, oh, but yeah, do you know I what I mean? Stomach. I think yeah, those yeah. don't have eggs. I think the other ones, like the cookie ones that we like to eat, mm-hmm. 
That ha- that's like raw eggs, but that dude, that shit upsets your fucking stomach. Have you eaten like two of those? <laughs> like bake two cookies and then eat two raw cookies, you know, and see what your stomach <laughs> feels like. <laughs> you, think it- it, you do not feel good. It's not good, but but boy, do they taste good. Uh, I'd rather eat raw cookie dough um, more than cookie any or baked cookie any day. I love cookie dough. Did you just grab four beers? What's wrong with you? <laughs> I grabbed two. Is everything I, okay back at home? Oh, everything's great back at home. <laughs> it's back, back at home. Man. I feel like drinking. Baby, do you. You deserve it. Ugh. I love it. Before we continue, we want to give a big thank you to our next sponsor of this podcast, ZocDoc. Guys, imagine this. You're trying to find a cause for your symptoms, such as a rash or you got a bad cough, and you stumble down a TikTok rabbit hole full of questionable advice from so-called experts. There's better ways to get the answers you want and the care you deserve from trusted professionals and not random people on the internet. Exactly. So ZocDoc helps you find expert doctors and medical professionals that specialize in the care you need and deliver the type of experience you want. And when you're not feeling your best and just trying to hold it together, finding great care shouldn't take up all your energy. And that's where ZocDoc comes in. Using their free app that millions of users rely on, you can find the right doctor that meets your needs and fits your schedule. So book an appointment with a few taps in their app and start feeling better faster with ZocDoc. Exactly. So go to ZocDoc.com slash Zayden Heath and download the ZocDoc app for free. Then find and book a top rated doctor today. Many are available within 24 hours. Again, that's ZocDoc.com slash Zane and Heath. Again, that's ZocDoc.com slash Zane and Heath. I actually just used ZocDoc to book a gastroenterologist. Why? I've been having a bunch of tummy pain and I don't know what it was. And it was so easy. Oh, oh dude. Last, like, I thought gastro, you meant like you, you want, you're going to get a gastro uh, bypass. No, that's gastric bypass. Oh, but, gastric bypass. But okay, okay, I'm okay. sure we can do that on the app too. <laughs> exactly. So guys, make sure to check out ZocDoc. Um, ZocDoc, <clears throat> ZocDoc.com slash Zayna Heath. We also tried the self-driving oh. taxi. What's it called? It's Waymo. Like a, Waymo. It's, it's a Uber oh. without a driver. Yeah. What a bizarre sensation. Was it slow? It looked like it was driving pretty no, slow. It was going it, the, the exact speed limit. Did it really? try to talk to you? <laughs> no, it was silent. Like when you get in, it's like, hi, Mariah. Yeah. Um, and then when you leave it, like, and then it you tells you to, like, you to put your seatbelt on, which I love. That's good. Um, um, but the, I will say it does go the speed limit. I felt pretty safe in it. It was wild, but the reflexes were really good. Yeah. Like there was, there was people that like pulled over last minute and then it would like swerve around them. So the reflexes are there. So I'm wondering if it was gonna get hit, kind of like a Tesla. You know how like Teslas will inch up by itself if yeah. some, someone's gonna hit them. I feel like it does that. Oh, I. Um, speaking of Tesla, I just experienced for the first time. I've never, um, I've never ha- um, merged over to the next lane while somebody else was doing it at the same time. Uh, that was the first time ooh. in my Tesla doing it. The reaction my Tesla did was in. See, oh, it, it brought completely you back? Completely banked. Oh, I was, wow. I was turning, turning, and then it took my fucking wheel and it went like that. And I, whoa, like, damn. I, I would have, oh, wow. it either would have been a close one or I would have hit the guy if that Tesla did not catch it. But that reaction of that was insane. Wow, it's amazing. It completely turned my car like that That's way. Crazy. Opposite way. That was pretty crazy. Save yeah. your life. I, I, I think I would have, I would have, I, I, I would have caught it, but <laughs> I liked how it, 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 it felt sense good. that. Uh, but Respect. yeah, it was a very, very strange yeah. feeling being in it. Uh, I will say it did make one turn that I was like, Whoa. Ooh. Whoa. Yeah, I definitely was... would have done it. Did you have, have to like... sign an agreement though? Like, are you signing your life away by getting in one of those? Or is it like, if an accident happens, you probably, may be entitled to some money. Probably. When I downloaded the app, I was like, next, 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 next. <laughs> skip, uh, skip, oh, skip, skip, skip. If you had to do a bunch of next, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you did. But I really liked it. We definitely, I was wondering why we, we don't have them here yet, but oh, we definitely couldn't handle it here. No way. It would be trashed in five seconds. No, and not only that. Nobody like, respects these things. It was like the, the scooters got the banned, got banned in different locations because people were throwing <laughs> them in the trash. Like, my heart breaks for the little I, robots that deliver yes. food. Stop, like, don't stop cry. if you stop messing with it. If you see somebody <laughs> messing move with over. A, get out of the way. If you see somebody messing with a robot oh. that's delivering someone's food, leave it alone. Just leave it. And it has eyeballs and a name. But, like you don't feel that. And not only that, we're trying to like we're trying to advance <laughs> as cry. a society. I look love at them. Kids. They're so they look like friggin' minions. Oh, they are. What's that one's name? If anyone needs a gun, it's them <laughs> <laughs> to be like back, <laughs> back the fuck up. <laughs> you want to fucking talk? Get get your hands off me. Yeah, right. Oh, is it does the lid so lock? Cute. 
until it gets to the... I think it, yeah, I it think does. I lost. I was going to yeah. say, because people would just be... <laughs> yeah, yeah, that the, shit. Uh, the studio that I dance at, there every time I take class, there's the same one that pulls up like Sarah. <laughs> she'll pull, Sarah. She'll pull Sarah. up and sit by the <laughs> sit by the window and figure out where the hell she's supposed to go because there's always like construction there and she's just lost and I'm <laughs> looking out the window. I missed eight counts. Oh. I just feel so bad. Jordan saw two of them go head to head and it, they didn't know what to do because they were both blocking each other. <laughs> and it was waiting for the other one to move. Like, oh, oh, it was just oh. like a standoff. I feel so bad, but they're great. Wait, all terrain. Look so at that. How, like, how long does it take for that thing to go get your food and come back? <laughs> a long time. I, it has sure. to take long. Well, well I think they're it only in like small, like tighter areas. Like uh, the ones that I see, they're on Melrose. So they're only hopping from yeah. apartment to like, they definitely wouldn't be one here. That would take so a long wait. time. <laughs> it's, only going, it's only going like two like, or three blocks. Yeah, it's hold not on, going on. through the Hollywood Hills. <laughs> Who is loading them up? The restaurant. The restaurant. And so, the so they're just sitting in the restaurant and then the rest. They pull they up to the people order it. They uh, pull up to the restaurant. The restaurant sees them and they. That's crazy to me. That's crazy. <laughs> Technology is wild. That's Dude, imagine crazy. in fucking like it, t that 10 years later. What is it? What is it going to do? What is it going to do? I have a feeling we are so close to iRobot. It's not even funny. <laughs> Like I just love ro uh, videos of people like pushing robots and them like <laughs> but coming Aww. back up, like just testing their yeah, and get agility. Oh, when they they like shove the robot and it catches its footing. Yeah, yeah, that that was I robot too. I, 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 I robot too. Remember that was I robot too. When they were really nice, you push them, they get up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and then all of a sudden, and then one they day. fight back. They rustle and tussle. The, uh, the Come with me as we rustle and tussle at oh, the guest Oh, those combat. do backflips. Yeah. That one does a backflip. Yeah, no, send that, these people into war. That, that one is going to be risky. Make a battle, battle of the bots. Like if and the, make if them the whole indestructible. World, if just, yeah, like if if we could just replace Oops. humans with just robots. Bro, why does that remind me of Ilya? <laughs> For war. This is you the new Zila robot. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I do think is really crazy, though? Exoskeletons. Go on. Basically, you are inside of a robot. And oh. It, it like gives you like super strength. Like, yeah, so it, like can, Avatar, can, like Edie Falco's like having yeah, a cup of you coffee. you can like and lift and hold things and move around. Oh, yeah, that, that's wild. That's really cool. Or an Edge of Tomorrow. They, they, have, they, haven't ha they don't have anything like that yet, do they? Um, there's definitely like prototypes of them. Oh yeah, for sure. You know what, how, I just learned this recently. This is a little off topic. How long do you think it is to climb Mount Everest? Days? Uh, I, th I think weeks, um, no? I would guess the whole trip, I'd say about a week. Oh, uh, five days? That's, That's what I thought. You know how long it is? Two months. No. Months? Look up how about two months. It takes about two months to climb Mount Everest. Non -stop? This whole time, I thought it was just a rough couple days. <laughs> <laughs> and you make no, it. I knew that it uh, wasn't. Uh, dude, rough. I was just watching. I'm I was thinking. I go. Right I now. was like, hmm, how is that just? Matt, it takes a couple of days to get up to Runyon. <laughs> right. Uh, well, I, is, no that, is that a nonstop or a round trip? Is that there? <laughs> To for hike some, to the top for of some the, to people, the peak. it's a one way. Okay, how long? Okay, it takes about two oh, months sorry. to climb Mount Everest. That's terrible hunting. Um, terrible. Yeah, a group of 12 climbers up to the Himalayas in late March and doesn't expect them to come back until late May. Okay, what is this? Oh, sorry. Imagine your summer vacation. So they're that. bringing two months worth of food on their back? I bet, I bet at the base camps they have like big oh, stashes. They have, and they wait, what, what, what do you mean base camps? So there's camps along the way yeah. as you work your way up there it's, it's become there's a, like flat areas like that up up on the mountain not, not necessarily like super flat and like hang out but there's stations because it's become a business now yeah so you pay these guides like an absurd amount of money to be able to go do this trip oh and wow. they, will, they will take you See, all look, the way there, up there's like a dutch bros <laughs> uh, but yeah they have like tents and stuff set up i never want to do it no no i never never that ever but not my Heath, you know what Heath is looking at it like Backpacking uh, too, you know what? I bet no. it's so fucking cool to like people that love oh, this gosh. shit. You got to pass bodies and stuff up there, man. No, but you're. I don't think you're going that far into it. Like, I think a norm, like a normal hiker that's like doing this for fun, is probably only doing it for a few days and coming back. No, so like, you, you're not you going all the way. You can't go super high because the elevation. Your like body has to get used to being. You got to take um, your time. It's like be. It's like scuba diving when you're underwater. Yeah. Wait you a can't second. Just shoot back up, right? Go back to that. Gradual. You're going as high as plane. Oh my god! It's the tallest. 
the tallest mountain in no, the world? No, I, I just yeah, did 35,000 feet. That, that's that's how high we were when I when I skydived. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like that's insane. That's, <laughs> that's insane. It is pretty wild that it's about the same depth as the Marianas Trench. The highest the other and way. the lowest. Oh, I do have a good caption if I made it up there though. What What's would it be? Caption? What do you got? At my, at my peak. <laughs> go you can do that at you can go do that at run yeah, tomorrow. <laughs> But peak. this is the ultimate peak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can imagine getting up there and just it there is just cloudy. Like <laughs> someone's oh, like you made it to the top, you get to see no view, and you get that picture, and it's just like, like I was on Everest. I made it to Mount. You Everest. might as well take a selfie in the shower when it's when it's awesome. And I'm, you're above the clouds anyway, so I'm sure looking out, you're just looking down at clouds. I guess so. Is there cell phone reception up there? Like you can't post anything. Yeah, they, yeah, they have it. They have each. They have five towers for each carrier <laughs> for for the one person. That's you could there. probably connect to a plane's Wi-Fi as it's passing. Go 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 go. go. <laughs> that, that, that's months. that's another thing that doesn't make sense to me. Plane's the Wi-Fi. service about being up on a mountain should be better. You know what? I You're don't closer understand? to the satellite. Got to build more towers. Has the internet been really slow for you guys lately? Like I'm yes. talking about your your generic cellular Everything. data. It has been crazy slow. Mike said it, it's happening like nationwide. Okay. Oh, that. Oh, you're talking about just in the past few days. Yeah. Like off yeah. Wi-Fi, your cell phone signal is just very been really bad. bad. I have to. Normally, I have to hop off Wi-Fi because the Wi-Fi sucks usually. But now I need to hop on Wi-Fi constantly. Yeah. I don't know what's going on. And d- my all of a sudden my, I don't know if it was because of Japan. Since I've been back from Japan, my 5G thing has not gone to its normal um oh that's annoying what do you mean like the 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 5g the symbol mm-hmm. has not changed back to it and i've done everything on my phone that i needed to do strange you know what i learned i for the longest time i was always lte because i thought that was like i faster, love lte but 5g is apparently better than lte oh, but lte when yeah, i see LTE, lte i feel better yeah i feel better lte feels elite lte feels like you're yeah mm. 5g feels like you're Mm. <laughs> struggling <laughs> I'm, ta- right, I'm tired <laughs> I'm tired I'm no, over should we play that think, game? Uh, yeah let's do that name game y'all were playing oh my oh. god I love that were game were you gonna t- finish no I was just thinking about 5G I'm trying to remember what it was I think it's the um, the frequency of the wave is like super 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 um, tight so I think that's why it's like the wavelengths uh, it's, it's, of it, yeah, like the it's, crescents of it's stronger, but that's why they need towers so much shorter because it can't travel as far as like, uh, like a longer wavelength. Okay, that makes sense. I'm just like, if they're building a lot, I'm investing in the companies. <laughs> I'm just like, where can I profit in this? I'm just yeah, buying right. stocks. They're spending so much money making them look like trees. Just build another one. <laughs> For it's okay. Yeah. Why isn't there one in the hills? Because they're rich. Why people. isn't there one? in the hills why it's crazy that people spend so much more money to live in the shitty hills and mm. uh but no towers up there because there they're no wealthy benefits. and they ask their local governments not to do it because they so also they believe it causes cancer that's why if you go to the hamptons there oh, isn't any he, cell phone signal in the hamptons get, good luck trying to get an uber out there get over yourself get over yourself oh, god these fucking rich people man I, well just get over yourself <laughs> well to be fair it probably is very bad for you. Then get rid of your microwave then. Get rid of everything <laughs> in your house that causes fucking uh, cancer. It's crazy. Uh, uh, the tower, mm. They probably sit next to their phone every night. You know what, get rid of your dry shampoo. Hey, thank you. Cancer. Thank you. Mm. Dry shampoo? Put Stop a, donating to Big Pharma. Put a- uh, get, <laughs> They get rid of cancer. Uh, put an extra car battery in a, in a spare microwave. <laughs> in case there's an EMP, you got a Faraday cage. Like fuck to off. To protect your your battery. Sure. Did you I'm ever know anybody who? Would, no, no. I'm sorry. I'm still fighting. Oh. Did you ever know anybody who would like put their microwave not in their kitchen but like put it like in their pantry? They'll put like or like it's down. It's like not high up, but it's yeah. lower. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Some people like do that oh. in their or in houses a, in a drawer because they don't want to like if they are having people over who have pacemakers and stuff. They don't want just to like make that be a risk or anything, and they just put it like away. I don't know. Since now they're tra- they're trying to cancel air the fryers. air fryer. I'm like, and they made Yo, everybody that freaked buy me it. Out. That freaked me out though. <laughs> and now, but for what, what? what? I don't get it. Your it air fry, you. your air fryer is fine. The ones that are like the dish ones that go in and out. The it's the type of like paint that they put in at that in the basin of it. That oh. like wait, we, wait, when ours does is it like that. End? Oh y'all, no y'all. Oh, I'm we have the, your dry your the one that. 
free the the no, dryer. No, that's, that's not that's not air fryer. Oh, th this one. Yeah, yeah. If it's like painted black and stuff, that oh, I don't know. Is. I'm not gonna make. It, I'm not trying to do any fear mongering and make people uh, return back your air fryers. Just do your research. I because I was because uh, we're making our little wedding registry and we're putting stuff on there. You're, you're and gonna my, get heat, uh, heat back to. Well, that's why we need to do farming. That's why we need to go back to trading. Yes, <laughs> yes. You need to trade goods. Trade goods. Get, bring back the barter system. Huh? Yes. <laughs> Unbelievable cancer. Air frying oh. equipment is known to cause cancer. It's not oh. known to cause cancer. <laughs> <It's> but <laughs> the process of air frying does result in the formation of certain compounds like alchloramide, alchloramide that are linked to cancer development. Alchloramide is classified you know as- Everything's have, linked to a sickness. Have you ever heard of the Yucca app? No. It's this like app. Why you see? This isn't an ad, but it's like you go scan the barcodes of like your shampoos and stuff and it will like- Sends all the ingredients and it says like if it's Wait. safe or clean oh, or not. Oh, it's called yucca. Y u k a. That's very interesting because yucca actually has cyanide in it. I wonder if that's why they picked. What's yucca? Like a like a root yucca. Oh yeah, like it's a carrot. Is the icon? So yeah, ah, right? Is it very good? Hot stuff. Go it's to, pretty interesting. I went through like in, all my in. shampoos and stuff and like made sure now, everything that, I had was type clean. In yucca. That would freak me out. That's definitely what it. Those are for hypochondriacs. Yeah. It has cyanide in it. It's Y U C C A. Oh, there's a but, there's but, a Yucca Street in Hollywood. Type in um, type in cyanide. Yucca. Poison. Hollywood yeah, is poison. Going, uh, Do you remember that cartoon Cyanide and Happiness? Yes. Where it was like the little like oh yeah uh, orange Vine. shirt blue shirt. They on were Vine. Very, it was on Vine. There'd be some little clips of it, but it was like a little dirty cartoon. Before we continue, we want to give a big thank you to our next sponsor of this podcast, DoorDash. Do you love the convenience of getting what you want right to your front door? With DoorDash Grocery Delivery, you can stock up for the week or order last minute cravings conveniently. You've trusted DoorDash to deliver your restaurant favorites, and now you can get grocery delivery that actually delivers too. With thousands of grocery stores to choose from, you'll find the best in your neighborhood and boost your local economy with each and every order. And you're going to get exactly what you ordered or they'll make it right. So sit back and enjoy the quality groceries just like you picked them up yourself. Mm -hmm. And want even more value? You can save on all your grocery and restaurant favorites with a $0 delivery fee on all eligible orders with a Dash Pass membership. And with easy substitutions right in the app and best-in-class customer support, DoorDash delivers groceries exactly how you want it. So get 50% off your first DoorDash so get 50 so get 50 off your first DoorDash order up to a ten dollar value when you use code heath mm. at checkout limited time offer terms apply baby that's 50 percent off up to a ten dollar on a 15 minimum subtotal and zero delivery fees on your first order when you download the DoorDash app in the app store and enter code heath one more time so you don't forget that's code heath for 50 percent off your first order with DoorDash, baby thank you so much DoorDash. we love ya all right should we do the uh, the word game yeah let's do it Okay. I don't even know what to call it. It's like a uh, rhyming <clears throat> name game. The diss name track. Game. It's the I name named it, game. I named it the rap name game. The rap name game. All right, you guys ready for your first name? <laughs> Jordan, your outfits are just, I've never seen anything. I, like I gave him a, a quilt and that's what he turned it into. Did you really? I'm sorry, what? You're just giving him. You it was that? it was for, it was on his bed. Do you, do you have a oh. sewing machine, Jordan? I do have a sewing machine. That's But dope. I do not make this. You want to sew me something nice? Yes. Okay. All right. All right. Let me give you guys this name. Give us and the, the word. First word is Emma Stone. Emma Stone. Emma Stone. Um, Emma loves ice cream. That's Emma Cole. <laughs> Emma Stone with Macaulay Culkin. That's Emma Home Alone. Oh! <laughs> Emma Super focused. That's Emma in the zone. Oh, ooh. <laughs> Emma's got a call coming in. That's Emma phone. Okay. <laughs> Emma flying high, baby. That's Emma drone. <laughs> Emma Yabadoo, that's Emma Flintstone. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Little Wayne. Uh, wait, we okay. Uh, we didn't even get to exhaust. Little Wayne needs a tide to go. That's Little Stain. Oh, <laughs> Little Wayne taking over the world. That's Little Bane. <laughs> oh. um, Little Wayne loves Chinese food. That's Little Lo Mein. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Lil Wayne getting tired of this game. That's <laughs> that's Lil Drain. <laughs> <laughs> Lil Wayne, the neurologist. That's Lil Brain. Hey, hey. Lil Wayne's got a limp. That's Lil <laughs> Kane. Lil, Lil Wayne's tits are getting cold. That's Lil Rain. <laughs> uh, Lil Wayne is Heat's partner. That's Lil Zane. Oh! 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 Ah! <laughs> Helen Keller. 
Oh. Helen works at a bank. That's Helen Teller. Hey. <laughs> Helen, Helen plays the drum. That's Helen Miles Teller. <laughs> <'Cause> <laughs> it, 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 it sounds like other names. Frank Ocean. Um, Frank Ocean's a witch. That's Frank Potion. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Frank Ocean driving a car. That's Frank Motion. Ooh, Frank Ocean got ashy elbows. That's Frank Lotion. <laughs> Frank Ocean's part of the boys in motion. That's Frank Devotion. <laughs> oh, oh my God. That was like a triple. <laughs> yeah, that's. <laughs> oh, yeah. You, get, you, you get, know what it was. You get double points for that? It's kind of cheating. I mean, it's a little, didn't... that's a Raven reference hey. if you're confused. <laughs> Frank be hanging out with them boys. That's Frank Brotion. Come on. Woo! Hey. Hey. Nice. <laughs> Frank's in a fight with his friends. That's a Frank commotion. Whoa. <laughs> oh, Vincent this... Van Gogh. Van, uh, Vincent Van Gogh. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Vince Mama got killed in that Bambi movie. That's Vince Van Doe. Oh! <laughs> Yo, Vince took some of that Ferkus set. That's Vince Van Slow. Hey! <laughs> Vince is always freaking in them. She's that's Vince Vin, Vince Von Ho. No. <laughs> oh, Vince's car broke down. That's a Vince Van Toe. <laughs> so, that was good. I, I'm having a hard time remembering the. First I know. It's like, it's like Wait, the first and middle name. Yeah, <laughs> but when you start it, you just say the first just name. The first of that. Name. Yeah, but sometimes if you if it slips in, it's fine. Okay, okay. <laughs> Paul Revere. Uh, Paul Revere. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, Paul is in the ER. His condition is Paul Severe. Whoa, <laughs> okay, that's good. That's good. Paul Revere. Paul, oh. Paul be saying it from the heart, baby. That's Paul Sincere. Oh. <laughs> to college that's paul career no! <laughs> paul went to the spa he got a paul pedicure uh -oh. oh pedicure <laughs> oh revere <laughs> pedicure i don't sorry Pet career paul saw something on the road that's a paul got a veer nice there we go he's right, back right. he's back Sorry. Paul's got a new set of teeth that's paul veneer oh. Oh. Okay. Paul said, don't take his orders to go that's paul for here oh! <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> Paul, Paul doesn't good. give up. That's Paul Persevere. Hey. All right. All right. No, he doesn't give up. I love when he goes like that. And then Paul, <laughs> Paul, showed, Paul showed up out of nowhere. That's Paul Appear. <laughs> Oh, my God. Paul Pierce. <laughs> oh, Man, Paul, is... wait. This is so, this is such a stretch. Well, the, hey. <laughs> hey, Paul likes the sound of music. That's Paul, a deer, a, a female deer. deer. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, I don't know what this word means, but I'm going to see if I can even make this sense. <laughs> Careful. Paul has no time. idea what's going on. That's Paul adhere. <laughs> And take, take your time. Zach. No, that and your, here, A D H E R E. What's that? Ad, mean? Adhere, adhere means to like stick, <laughs> like adhesive. Adhere. Paul, to, Paul always trying to stick. That's Paul adhere. Woo! Paul always trying to stick. <laughs> oh um, man, Vin Diesel. Vin Diesel. Ooh, Vin, Ooh. Vin, Vin, Vin's a little slimy. That's Vin Weasel. Vin, Vin knows how to pop. That's Vin Pop the Weasel. Oh, oh wait, 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 yeah. I, I hate. I know, I know. Go ahead, go ahead. Vin knows how to pop. That's Vin knows how to pop. That's <laughs> Vin knows how to pop. That's Vin Peasel. Oh. oh, Vin Vin knows how to pop. That's Vin Weasel. <laughs> Uh, uh, Vin is getting really into painting lately. That's Vin Easel. Oh, very nice. Right. There we go. <laughs> the, the motions to explain. Vin, Vin's been getting haunted. That's Vin Cecil. So, oh, like, Cecil Hotel? Oh, so, oh <laughs> nice. No, Vin, I Vin was found in a water tower. <laughs> yes. a, I did not understand that one. Uh, right. You see? <laughs> Vin trying to watch his profanity. That's Vin G Jeezel? Jeezel? What does that mean? Jesus. Oh, like G. That's been Jeezel. I love the dumb ones like that. Like, that makes me happy. Yeah. <laughs> like, where it's not a word, but you like. Michael Myers. Oh. oh like, Michael works for Michelin. That's Michael Ty. 
Myers. <laughs> no, nah, that's good. Why'd oh. you hesitate? Oh, I think because it was so obvious. I liked. Sorry. No, it wasn't. Oh, okay. That was good. Michael's been working as a mailman. That's Michael Flyers. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Uh, Michael was on Stranger Things. That's Michael. Where's Will Byers? <laughs> Michael likes his ice cream cold. That's Michael Breyers. Oh, good. <laughs> I hate, I hate Breyers. I know. That shit doesn't even come with a lid on it. You, oh, you know, if you leave Breyers out it, when, it and it melts, melt. it doesn't melt. <laughs> it stays to its original form. <laughs> That's terrible. Mike should be eating Dryers. That, that's the better one. Oh, There's okay. Briars and dryers. Um, y'all see, uh, y'all see my, y'all <laughs> see Michael on that Donald Trump show. That's Michael Fires. Woo! Very good. <laughs> Michael be lowering the unemployment rate. That's Michael Hires. Nice. There we go. Very good. Yes. Very good. Michael was in the bling rig. That's Michael <laughs> Alexis Nyers. I don't know the, what any of those are. This is Alexis Nyers calling. <laughs> Nancy Joe, this is Delicious Nyers. Ooh, ooh, ooh. My <laughs> Michael's milk is kind of chunky. That's Michael expires. Whoa, good. Oh, I like damn. that one, Zane. Zane, this is your name. Go ahead. <laughs> Logan Paul. Logan's showing us what he got at the store. That's Logan Hall. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Logan always making me laugh. That's Logan Law. <laughs> <laughs> Logan went shopping. That's Logan Mall. <laughs> Logan is keeping us waiting. That's Logan's stall. Mm, period. <laughs> <laughs> Logan's tripping. That's Logan fall. Oh, oof. Oh, that, oh, I was just thinking that. Logan can't walk yet. That's Logan crawl. Oh, okay. Mm. Mm. Why are easier Lo names harder to come up <laughs> with? Well, uh, I'm not excited about like any of the ones I'm thinking of. Like, yeah, I can they're, think they're of a lot and I'm like, I'm like, I got something better. I got something better. Yeah, they're basic. Let's because you, Logan, you wanted, Logan boxing in the yeah. ring. That's Logan Brawl. Ah, Elijah Wood. That one I just didn't. Elijah Wood. Elijah Wood. Okay. Um, <laughs> Elijah. Elijah oh, always saying that he always can't. When Elijah could. <laughs> Elijah regretted his decision. That's Elijah should. Nice. <laughs> Elijah pulling up. <laughs> Elijah pulling up with a Glock. That's hey. Elijah Hood. Ooh. Nice. <laughs> Matt. <laughs> I thought of I thought of doing Hood, and I was like, I don't know where to go with Hood. <laughs> Oh, Elijah's off to see his grandmother. That's Elijah Little Red <laughs> Riding Hood. Very good. Elijah doesn't see eye to eye with his friends. That's Elijah like misunderstood. misunderstood. <laughs> I was trying to That's come good. up with something. That's good. There we go. That. Ah. All right, next one. Jamie oh, Fox. Elijah got a cut on his arm. That's Elijah Blood. <laughs> Blood. <laughs> Blood. Joe Biden. <laughs> oh. Joe's really good at hide and seek. That's Joe hiding. Nice. <laughs> He's kind of spoiled. I know. <laughs> Wait, Joe can't keep or Joe won't let the public know what's really going on. <laughs> That's Joe hiding. <laughs> <laughs> hold on, hold on. Ooh, hold on. <laughs> Joe be keeping secrets among Congress. That's Joe confiding. God damn oh! it! Joe wants to have a little one on one with you. That's Joe confiding. Like, oh, damn. Nah, I think that was the only one that was really good left. Joe be giving out money to everybody. That's Joe providing. <laughs> damn. <laughs> damn. Very good. My, God, my brain is like. <laughs> I thought it'd be fun if you guys did each other's names. So I don't know if you guys want to do like Matt King, Ooh, Mariah Amato. But Matt King would be good. Matt just got engaged. That's Matt Ring. Mm -hmm. Oh, I heard Matt's got a big pee pee. That's Matt Dingaling. <laughs> <laughs> Matt's got some nice pipes. That's Matt saying. Hey. Nice. <laughs> Matt's making a lot of money off his brandios lately. That's Matt Cha Chang. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I thought of just the worst. I could. What? So, <laughs> Matt be seeing some side bitches. That's, That's Matt, Matt Fling. Fling. <laughs> 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 Ooh. Ooh, Matt. Your fiance's looking good. That's Matt Ting. <laughs> I'm sorry. Like, mate, like mating? <laughs> no, I'm you got it. What did I say? Matt, Matt ting. ting. Yeah, like, like oh, she a Ting. No, what, you never heard that? What's a Ting? <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, you a bad Ting. No. What? Matt thinks he's Italian. That's Matt bada boom bada bing. <laughs> <laughs> Mm, I mean this this hits back this hits back home, but Matt Matt used to live with Zane and Heath in that first apartment. That's Matt Kling. Whoa! <laughs> and it was on Clay. Wait, dude, did you mean to do a double one? 
clingy and it was on Kling Street. Yeah, Kling Street. I, oh, I think oh, he was I thought you meant like, like he was clinging on. Oh, you. no, no. Oh. Nice. No, I didn't mean to do that first cling, but I meant the street. Well, you got oh. a double. Damn, that was good. Okay. Oh, do you I get, own it? Yeah. Oh, oh shit. Okay, we'll cut a, that. A double on a Double on top, baby. Let's do Zayn Hajazi. Oh, you know what, Matt? Matt is dancing on and on. That's Matt Bring. Oh, there bring you go. It, bring it on. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Matt be sopping wet, baby. That's Matt Ring. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Matt, you've been feisty lately. That's Matt Sting. Nice. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Matt be getting all them little one liners. That's Matt Zing. <laughs> <laughs> These are good. I can't. I'm blacking out. Do you, do you like Jazzy? It's good luck. Uh, no, we no got Zane it. speaking a lot of nonsense. That's Zane Fugazi Fugazi. <laughs> oh, what? that was good. That was good. Zane got a BBL. That's Zane Stasi. <laughs> <laughs> Zane, uh, Zane's got all them beautiful angels. That's Zane Bazu. Nice. Z wait, this one. That's Zane, good. Zane might kill himself. That's Zane Kamikaze. <laughs> oh, oh my God. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> Zane likes Z Zane likes keeping up with the Osbournes. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Zane Ozzy? Ozzy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That uh, Zane be hitting all them angles, baby. That's Zane Paparazzi. Oh, oh! All right, God. All right. <laughs> this is, uh, oh my God! There's something wrong with Zane's bag. That's Zane's cereal, <laughs> cerebral <laughs> palsy. <laughs> <laughs> no, Wait, no, you. <laughs> Did he really just rhyme Hajazi <laughs> cerebral palsy? There's no way I got that right. I said there's something wrong with my bag. Is it a disease or a condition? Sorry if I condition. I think right. Yeah, Zane's got to find himself. A little Miss Americana. That's Zane Halsey. Oh, <laughs> I don't know, it, was, it was just something on the back. Look, of look, Zane, Zane could extra. kick your ass. That's Zane Karate. Oh, <laughs> okay. I'll allow it. Because you did karate. Yeah, no, no. I know. I know. <laughs> what? Zane, Zane did a porno. That's a Zane Bukaki. <laughs> 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 Wait, I got. I thought we were rhyming with like Zi, <laughs> or it could be anything like. You, gotta I -E. you know how Nicki Minaj raps? Yeah, it's so it's like as long as it's I E. Yeah, just like sounded out a little different. You guys should do Mariah though. Now. Okay, Mariah's promiscuous. That's Mariah Furtado. Oh Ooh, <laughs> damn! <laughs> Mariah's getting lucky. That's Mariah Lotto. Oh. <laughs> Mar Mariah's got to go to the um, Mariah's got to go to the farmer's market. She don't know if she's going to get uh, Mariah tomato tomato. <laughs> that was too long. That was way too long. Let me redo that. Just Let me redo that. Mar 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 Mariah don't, needs Mar some produce. Mar Mar Mariah store. don't know which vegetable to gate. Gate. <laughs> <laughs> Mariah don't know which. <laughs> Mariah don't know which produce she's going to get. That's Mariah tom tomato tomato. Oh. Tomato, 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 tomato. tomatoes. Mariah likes her coffee with ice cream. That's Mariah Afogato. Nice. Oh! <laughs> Mariah's feeling a little bit digital lately. That's Mar <laughs> Mariah Roboto. <laughs> Mariah be hitting them notes. That's Mariah Vibrato. Oh, 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 that right I, got a, I got a good name. <laughs> Mariah don't know who that Latino artist is. It sounds like Mariah Malato. Ooh. 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 <laughs> wait, Mariah's, Mariah's. Wait, who's Malato? Yeah, I, I don't know. <laughs> oh, oh, wait, I got it. Mar Mariah's got that big dick energy. That's Mariah Lotto. <laughs> what? I'm a lot, okay. The singer? The singer. Her name's uh, Lotto. Oh, I'd never heard of her. All right. Um, oh, Mariah's getting freaky in that cave hot tub. That's Logic. Mariah Grotto. <laughs> it's like, where the hell is this going? That's funny. <laughs> Mariah wants to live in the mountains. That's Mariah Colorado. Okay. Whoa. Mariah's like a good neighbor. She's always there. That's Mariah Motto. <laughs> oh, okay. Motto. Uh, okay. No, yeah, that's okay. Good. Sorry. That's good. Sorry. Okay. Okay. No, all right. Okay, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mariah likes to pluck her violin. That's Mariah Pizzicato. Ooh, beautiful. <laughs> I like that one. Well, Mariah sees things abstract. That's Mariah Picasso. Oh. Mar Mariah's reading the diary of Anne Frank. That's Mariah Otto. <laughs> 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 
His name is Ottoman. Oh, I thought Otto. Oh, I thought autobiography. Know, wait. <laughs> oh my god, I'm getting doubles, doubles. <laughs> Hold on, wait, you know the characters' names and Anne, the diary yes, of Anne Frank. Yes. Oh, Zane, go, wait, that's who, a flex. Who is, who's Otto? Otto's the guy that saves her. Zane, that's a flex. Is that true? <laughs> yeah. What? Uh, Dane, I don't even know the characters in Anne Frank. Yeah, because you don't read. <laughs> All right, if if you know that, then you can't ever bitch about. N no, uh, just type in Otto. Otto Frank. Yeah. Damn, Zane. Zane. What? That's very impressive. Did you? I had to read it for school. So Sorry, so all. Your retention is incredible. Then. Yeah. You like World War Two, huh? Sorry, baby. Did I startle you? Should we do Heath? That's just like I would have did never. That, did that? Did taken you back? I'm very impressed. My big Heath? words. I taken. Heath oh, Heath is guitar. Heath plays an instrument. That's Heath guitar. Okay. There we okay, go. Okay. A little lazy. Okay. Uh, okay. Try it. No, no, no. You're right. You're right. Heath just be throwing them jokes out over and over. That's Heath too far. Oh, <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Oh, hey, Heath is trying to, Heath is searching for somewhere to drink. That's Heath, a bar. Oh, good. Okay. That's Heath, nice. Heath likes to eat steak. That's Heath tartar. <laughs> Tuna. <laughs> Wait, no, you can do steak You can steak tartare. Heath left his door open again. That's Heath a jar. <laughs> uh oh. Heath is lost SC. That's Heath R R. <laughs> How about like Heath found a treasure chest or like. <laughs> oh, lost at sea. <laughs> He's converting to mus. <laughs> <laughs> He is becoming a Muslim. That's Heath Allah Akbar. <laughs> that was good. That was I don't know what to do when people are doing your name because I feel like it's a, a roast. You feel like we're singing I, happy birthday. I'm like, yeah, yeah. I'm like just taking it. Heath's turning a little red. That's Heath Rosacear. <laughs> I'm sorry. Heath is becoming Australian. That's Heath Arnar. <laughs> <laughs> Heath Arnar. Arnar. <laughs> that was good. Heath is into high. <laughs> Heath is into high end fashion. That's Heath Bazaar. Oh, Bazaar is good. Like Heath's he, a Heath be weird. fighting Darth Vader. That's Heath Jar Jar. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> but technically, Darth Vader and Jar Jar Binks were. I've friends. never seen it <laughs> because he was Anakin Skywalker. I was the only other character I could think of. I know. <laughs> Can we pronounce Heath, it differently? Oh, okay, Heath has been the best student in class. That's Heath Star. Whoa, gold Star. Gold Star. <laughs> <laughs> Some people pronounce it Husser, so we could play with that. You could do Husser. Or Heath just entered the guest compound. That's Heath Tussler. <laughs> okay. What? Heath be saying all them bad words. That's, That's Heath, Heath Cusser. <laughs> <laughs> Heath be cleaning up after all y'all mess. That's Heath Busser. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. That was awesome. Let's do this. That was nice. Every episode. I think I needed that. I think we're gonna run out. Give me a good laugh. Ooh, my head hurts. <laughs> I got hot during that. My head, I know, I'm I'm dying. Before we continue, we want to give a big thank you to our next sponsor of this podcast, ShipStation. When it comes to saving money as a small business owner, every little bit helps. ShipStation gives you access to discounts of up to 84% off USPS and UPS rates, and you can manage every order from one simple to use dashboard. When you lower your shipping costs and make returns easy, your customers stay happy while you save money. And ShipStation hooks you up with industry-leading discounts, so you'll never worry about overpaying for shipping. Mm -hmm. Get up to 84% off USPS and UPS rates, and if that's not enough, use our promo code to try ShipStation for free for two months. Over 130,000 companies have grown their e-commerce business with ShipStation, and 98% of the companies that stick with ShipStation for a year become customers for life. And all your shipping is handled in a single dashboard. ShipStation effortlessly integrates everywhere you sell online, including Amazon, Etsy, eBay, Shopify, and more. So manage every order from one simple dashboard, automate routine shipping tasks, print shipping labels, easily compare rates and delivery times to optimize every shipment and automate delivery notifications. And with enterprise solutions that make warehouse optimization easy, ShipStation scales when you do. So worry less about the bottom line when you save money with ShipStation. Go to ShipStation.com and use code UNFILTERED today and sign up for your free 60-day trial. Again, that's ShipStation.com and use code UNFILTERED. Thank you so much, ShipStation, for sponsoring today's episode. We love you. Todd and I go get, um, Todd and I went to get a pedicure. The a pedicure. <laughs> Todd and I got a pedicure the other day and she was telling me 
that she wanted to do my nails also. She's like, manicure. And I was like, no, I like, I have no nails, please. I like, you just, you just do the feet. Like I, and I felt really bad because most people, they do both, you know, and that like, it's good business for them. And I felt really bad. I was like, I literally have no nails for you to file. Like it's, yeah, yeah. I bit them all. Like I'm down to the core. And she's like, oh no, I'm, I'm just gonna bring Oh no, honey, we give you, <laughs> we give you, we, we, like we just got in, we just got in nails where it helps you stop biting. I was like, what? Wait, what do you mean? What? It's like nails, you get, you get nails. They put the nails on and then they color it to your, to the color of your nail. I was, I like, was what do you mean? saying that when you were on Hoot and a Half to get like, why did it like, anyways, I'm like, she's like, they just got them in. I was like, well, let's do them. Yeah. And now you've sold me. Let's get these nails on. So she, you have them on right now. I chewed them off. Oh, <laughs> my. <laughs> there's no way. I Zay. chewed them off. No way. But look, I lasted three days. Look, I, it, it's but, better. Look, it's a, it's a start. Right? Look, so they put them on and it, it was way too long. That first day, dumb nails, they were like, um, you know those nails I'm talking about where you look at and you're like, that guy needs to that guy needs to clip his nails. Were they like, like hanging it, over? It looked like a witch's nails. Mm. Like it looked like a You could say you play guitar or something it, like that. No, it just it looked <clears throat> the thing is that it didn't look like clean nails because it was like painted over. It just it looked it just looked off. Yeah, yeah. And it Do you have like, any on right now or it's all gone? I have like two left. Let me see. Question. Is it gel X? Yeah. Oh, I have gel X. So you just put on so fake nails? Oh, so wait. Gel X is the new acrylic. So they put like the fake nail on top and then when they buff it down, it just looks like a nail. But I, these are my real nails. My thumb accidentally like chipped off. Mm -hmm. So to copy the length of my other nail, she puts gel X on this one to make it longer. Gotcha. The rest of your nails are real? Yeah, these are mine. Took me a long time to grow. But see how this one, I just took this one off today. This one like chipped. So now she's going to put gel X on this to match the and line. Bro, so you just got a <laughs> You got, I, you I got really a version. Thought... He, he got a version of like yeah, an they're acrylic new, They nail. just came out. Gel Wait, X just, it. Did it have like a taste to it to keep you from chewing or it was just- No, no. Well, so no. they're hard. So they're, they're um, it's hard plastic. It's like acrylic. Got so it. So the first like day it was working, right? And then the next day I just start like- Picking at it. I was it. picking at it. And then I was just like, oh, well, I might as well like play, like bite these because these are fake. Right? So I'm starting to like- Right, uh, uh, but you gotta be careful because it could rip your nail off. So they're glued to your so, nail. So I'm biting it and all, and I bit that top, that like the top oh, like no. barf. And then I was like, oh, this hurts. Yeah. Because they buff it out. They, yeah. they, <laughs> they um, what do you call it? Sandpaper, they yeah. sandpaper, make it soft. File, file it. Yeah, they file it down. I was like, oh, this sucks. So I grabbed nail clippers. I was like, okay, let me just clip them all down so I don't bite them. I clip them all down and I'm like, okay, they're a little longer than my real nails. Nails now, I won't touch them. I'm sitting there and I'm just like, <laughs> I just start picking, picking, picking. And I'm like, oof. And then I start biting and it starts like ripping off like a, like, oh, like when you have like a, a oh, sunburn. Mm -hmm. And I'm like ripping it off slowly. I'm like, oh, this feels nice. But it, like, it was in my real nail. So, but once I took it off, I was like, all right, well, that's it. Nine more to go. <laughs> <laughs> that's Nine crazy. More. Those are hard to take off. I don't know how you did that. Oh, I mean, it now was, he's going to go get them back. Just you, he, his Zane, I think big. I might want to get some every few days. You, you like, are add a add Some more extra layers to it. Just yeah. so I could. But boy, did it feel good. I, I have a, it's so bad. It is. It's like, you're, such a you're, nasty you're, habit. You're almost 30 years old. He is 30. Oh, oh wait, you are 30. Oh, wait, that's really bad. Shit. Yeah, yeah you're, you're, you're 30 wait, years old. As a 30 year old, fingers. that's like a really nasty habit. You should stop chewing your fingers. Yeah. I mean, it's a mix of stress and anxiety, but you just made it such a bad habit. Dude, imagine seeing like an elderly man like <laughs> eating his fingernails. <laughs> you, like, you know what I mean? Like, I, it's like a very. No, no, it thing. is. And, and, but I don't but, like, do it in public. I do get... it like when I'm by myself normally or like in the living room, like without people around. I don't I don't do it in front of people. That's kind of gross. But like the moment you look down, you're just like, what ha did you did your hands get caught in the in the. Well, what's what makes it really bad is the fact that you chew them till it's bleeding. Like you always are bleeding in a in a in the. Fingernail pain, like hangnails, all that stuff is so sensitive because mm. you do everything with your fingers. That's yeah. why, like, I don't want to do that because I know I, do so everything. I just wish you could feel the sensation I'm feeling and you would understand. It's hard when it's an, ad an addiction. Yeah. It's like um, you're addicted to it. I'm addicted to it. Oh, when I had that fake nail, I was like, 
and I was like, I was just like playing with it in my mouth. Maybe you should go like to a, a hypnotist. Yeah. Hmm. Like, like some, I feel like that I've would, heard, I've heard some of those works. Like it's yeah. scary how much those guys, those people yeah. work. A lot of people get hypnotized, mm. like out of smoking cigarettes. Yeah. You yeah. Go, I bet they could do it for your fingers, yeah. like really, because yeah. it's mm. not like like maybe they'll give you the fear of chewing your fingers. Or something. <laughs> the hypnotist is just like it's gross. <laughs> she's like she's like, like really hot. She's yeah. like, I don't find that attractive. <laughs> she goes, nobody will find you attractive. <laughs> this is a bad habit. I got it. And, and you're ask- thirty. Okay. I was. <clears throat> I was thinking, what if I was thinking, what if I just keep getting fake nails? And if you're gonna keep ripping them off, that's not good for your nails because yeah, you're, not, you're not breaking is, the habit. Do you you're swallow just, it or do you spit it out? Jesus, Matt, I'm not a fucking freak. You think I? <laughs> mm, that's I don't fucking know. crazy. You, I you swallow could, you should my just nails. Get them surgically removed so you never have to chew them off. Heath, I'm like, that's crazy. Because <laughs> then disgusting. you're like, because you get to chew on that, like, <laughs> Matt, I'm just. <laughs> you see the soccer coach that was digging in his butt and would smell it and like eat it and they, there's like a whole what? there's a whole co- compilation of him they like got rid of him because people were like this is disgusting we had a coach like that but he no the there the, there's like oh my his, like up in his nose in public there's a whole compilation in the is in this the like a professional of, coach i don't really did, i don't he want got it. fired right uh, yeah i think they he i don't he took booty it into a whole nother level. Wanna, I don't want to watch it. No, you have to see it. <laughs> I mean, it's in public, so it's not graphic, but it's just like it's how- in the, It's in the privacy of his own home, just- <laughs> that- <laughs> No, no, and he's like doing it next to people like during the he's game. He's like on a, the field, just look at him. Oh no. Get it, get it, get it. Looking around, and he's holding that it, shit. he's holding roll it. Roll it, roll it, eat Ew. it. Eat it, ew. <laughs> Hold on, wait for the butt stuff. <laughs> I want to I want to see the butt shit. Yeah, it's coming up. Oh, armpit check. Whoa. Oh, superstar. <laughs> Wait, all right, here we go. Where we go? Where we go? Come on. No. Oh, oh, he balled it up and rubbed it on him. This is a mess. God, that, enough. Enough with the. Heath, where, what's the. Oh, Wait. oh, here it is. Get that butt. Yes, dig it. Dig it. And There's no way. This guy's a freak. Up in there. He's like a toddler. Acting like he's stretching. Bro, you ain't fooling nobody. He is like a toddler. I mean, I, mm. no. Mm. Uh, Hold on, keep watching. And then the I, mouth. And then this, the mouth. At this point, this camera guy is uh, <laughs> he knows what only he's doing. catching yeah. that. Hold on, just this. The one sitting down is really good. Papa, how many times have you seen this? A lot. <laughs> In the butt. <laughs> Look at him smiling. <laughs> Bro, that's wild. Roll it. Oh! What are you rolling? What is he what rolling? Did he find? What, what did, did you find? find in your ass that you are now rolling <laughs> and playing with in your hand? And then sniff. I know uh, what it, I know what it is, Heath. Look at look at this front in the front. Hey, how we doing over here? And Chuck. Ew. Wow. Bro, it it doesn't stop. It I know like what the he's booty, created I, like a nervous tick or when yeah. he's like intense and watching yeah. games. Yeah, because he's, he's in the like, zone. Yeah, he doesn't yeah. care. Where I know he what is. the booty one is. What like I, butt lint? Like what he found? Lint. Butt lint. Uh, because you get boxer lint. Mm-hmm. Like what, like when you sit on the toilet, you get like boxer lint on. Sometimes I think it's boxer lint. Ugh. <laughs> Every once every episode, I'm just someone said he really puts the germ in Germany. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. What's a smell that you wish you could smell all the time? That's like uh, it's like not normal. Oh, not normal. Yeah, not normal. Uh, banana runs. Garlic. <laughs> banana runs. Garlic. I love gasoline. That's still that's still yeah. garlic. Wait, on the no, stove. that's that's still like a fruity. It's it's health. Um, like something that's like weird. Oh yeah, like gas smells really good. Gas is good. Gas. I don't like the smell. I love garlic cooking. Mm. I'll throw garlic. It's not weird. No, yeah, no. It's, 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 like it's just, a, a, it's just oh. like very stinky, I guess. Yeah. Like garlic is a very stinky. Yeah, it's smell. very pungent. Yeah. pungent. But every time I throw it on the stove, whoever walks in the kitchen, they're like, what are you making? That smells it's, it's just so one. It's, it's just, just one garlic. garlic loaf. Yeah. Oh, I love like pickle juice. Mm. Really? Pickle like, juice is or pepper, oh, or, oh. Dude, I'll open up like pepperoncinis and I'm just like, Oh, you know what I love? Sip a little pepperoncini juice as like a shot just to like feel something. The pink public bathroom soap. That's yes. Oh, damn. Isn't that just- Wait, what do you know about the pink? Oh, I think about urinal urinal, urinal cakes, like a fresh urinal cake. Lemon urinal cakes. You'll be peeing like in a brand new urinal cake. You're like, Mm, oh, this is- (laughs) They make you want to sit there. Stay here for a while. (laughs) Make you want to sit there. Yeah, the yellow urinal cakes are pretty good. Or the orange. I love, oh, I mean, Sharpie smells, but that's everybody. Yeah. Yeah. 
Maybe like, it's not that weird actually. Like like fresh cut wood, like sawdust wood. Mm, okay. That's wait, good. Wait, I take that back. Sorry. Not Sharpie. That expo bl- marker. N- no, the black. Remember that black marker? The permanent marker? That permanent black marker had a blue chunky. line on it. A blue one. That, that was like, you could kill somebody with that marker. Ooh. You remember that black one? What was that called? Are you thinking of the one with the, it was thick, silver? Thick, s- silver? Is Bubba, it silver? Is it is it weird that you've never seen one of those? Yeah. You had to have seen a urinal cake. Yeah, she's seen one. You've seen. You know what I would love? Oh, if wow. I was, uh, I, I, know, I wish like, it wasn't weird, but just having a urinal in your house. Oh, I know. Why? Like, I don't like that we have to like pee into like, a bowl every time that's like filled with water and it's this huge. But if you think about it, it's not a pretty thing to look at. Correct, correct, I understand. But if you had like such a big enough bathroom where it was like hidden, like if you were just rich enough and had like plenty of space, you could design a urinal, like I would much rather. But I'm not, I'm telling you right now, I'm not cleaning that shit. No, thank you. Of course not. You you have to clean your toilets. I'm not cleaning a urinal. I guess like a urinal is grosser to clean than a I think toilet. I think there's more because a toilet has a lid. Urinal's just out and about. Yeah, it's just urine though. You ain't pooping in but it. You yeah, know but you know what? There's no around. poop splatter. But when there's pee stain that's dried up, oh, that's the worst to clean. Wow, what a way to end it. We always go back to the pee pee cocky. Pee pee cocky. You know I like that. I kind of like that. <clears throat> All right. Well, that is it for the episode. Uh, make sure to check out Cremota Coffee. We got matcha. We have uh, cake cups, bag coffee, and we actually still have the discount up right now. If you use code unfiltered, you're going to get 35% off. Uh, so make sure to check that out, Cremota.com. Um, you can check out this episode. We post every Monday audio form on Spotify um, and Apple Podcasts. Yeah. And on Tuesdays, we post a video form on YouTube, youtube.com slash Zane and Heath, um, where you can watch it every Tuesday on YouTube at youtube.com slash Zane and Heath um, on Tuesdays. Also, make sure to check out our Patreon, patreon.com slash Zane and Heath. You're going to find everything we've ever posted on Patreon. As soon as you subscribe, you're going to get access to it. We do uh, early access to all the episodes, all ad free. We do a bonus episode every single month, either high or drunk with like a guest usually. Um, And then we also keep these cameras rolling for another like 20 ish minutes. Um, We call it our unwind and you can watch like a extended version of this podcast um, only on Patreon, patreon.com slash Zane and Heath. Wow. Well, thank you again for tuning to another episode of Zane and Heath on filter. We love you so much and we will see you next week. Toodaloo. Toodaloo, motherfucker.